Hello, for guys are here again, and we are back for episode 25 of the Guild of Dungeoneering. And we have a bunch of money. So we are going to unlock the Most Holy Grail Knight class. Uh, pretty straightforward. I'm going to put the chapel at the very top of the... Like a shining beacon or a ray of light, they come here today to fight the good fight. So pure and clean and almost always right. Bow in the presence of the most holy grail knight. Yes, put the chapel at the very top of the uh, guild there. I actually should put it there to make it uh, symmetrical, but oh well. I guess we are getting one of these later on anyway. Um, actually, I'm going to need to get this one probably. To make it symmetrical and then I probably will not care about these at all um, so we're going to head into this adventure here magnet mogul get inside get into the magnets boardroom we're going to try out the uh, Holy Grail Knight class, the new one, of course. Why wouldn't I? And see how that works. I didn't actually look at what their abilities are, but. Um, so let's let's try getting into this boardroom again. Uh, that's a level two. So we probably want to go around that sort of way. So let's put a thing here. I'll fight an additional miner, I suppose. Okay, so we have a bunch of healing. Uh, we can bypass the block there and heal, uh, counter that incoming damage the heels and um, I suppose we'll do that negate one of those Ooh. Ooh, that's a lot of damage we'll use mind strike I guess Ooh. if you take plus plus three damage in a turn, deal one magic damage. Oh, okay. Uh, we'll use the... Wait, what? We'll use the unblockable attack to counter their heal, pretty much. That's a lot of damage. So we take one damage and then heal three damage. We gain four, or we gain two, I mean, not four. Um, that would bring us down pretty significantly, so I think two damage is, or two heal is acceptable. We use that, heal some of our own, Effectively, effectively make them gain one health instead of two. Um, that would be blocked. Everything would be blocked. We'll do this, I guess. So we'll get to do damage thanks to their damage. Ooh. Um, that's four, isn't it? Yeah. But... If I do that, we survive. That was pretty close. 
Uh, I'll take that. Getting tenacious is going to be pretty good. Uh, nothing suitable there. I guess we'll put that there. No, you're not supposed to go that way. God damn it. Well, I guess that is the way to the chest, so I suppose that's good. We'll put a miner there and fight it so that we can gain some experience. So now we have Tenacious and Retribution in Chrome's mind. All good things. All good things. We have a stupidity though, which is slightly unfortunate, but not too bad. I mean, could have been worse, couldn't it? I have a feeling we're going to win this. Nice. Um, we'll take... Uh, that. I suppose. Yes, you do. Let's just fight this thing. Flattering bones. It's just level two. Well, maybe I shouldn't say just. That was unfortunate that they blocked that. Bonus magic damage there. We're actually not doing too hot. Hmm. We might actually lose this fight. Yeah, that's that's going to kill us. And I can delay for one more turn just doing that, but then I think, yeah, Tenacious will not activate this time because maybe I shouldn't have healed. Whoops. Ah, well. At least we took them out too. We always know they have no chance, especially when they wet their pants. But in the end, the guild survives. Hurrah! Hurrah! Hooray! <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, let's go with the Cardomancer, I guess. While we get a new... Holy Grail Knight. Oh, you should probably not be going on that level two. Uh. We don't have very many cards at the beginning as the Cardomancer, which is a bit ironic. Here you go, Rust Monster. Uh, I shall take the Street Jacket for the extra health. And then I suppose we're fighting that thing because we don't really have 
much choice in the matter. Do that. I'll take you out. And I'll take the daisy chain for some extra health. And then whatever's in the chest. Uh, shimmering cloak. Basically just things I already put on. That would gain, give us repel but also stupidity. That would get us cards. That would cause us to lose health, which is not something that I want. I'm just going to take a piece of gold, I guess. Go this sort of way. We have a level. We have three level threes there. That's. Uh, Avoid that corridor, obviously. kill himself now, but I'm going to kill him first. Because I can. Ooh, Demon Claw. I'll take that. Gets us some more cards, at least. Even if they may or may not be super useful. Uh, we'll fight a Nymph, I guess. Don't really fight very many of those. Ooh, you can seal. That's mildly annoying. We'll negate one of those damages and draw a card, I guess. Do that. Take some damage while we build our hand, pretty much. And then unleash one of these. And that was pretty perfect. Pop. Uh, definitely take that, gain repel, and keep the health bonus. Just lovely. We'll fight a mummy now, I guess. I. I guess these are the elite guards. Use repel on that. Poor little cursed mummy. Hmm. Let's focus on card draw. Unleash as large an attack as possible, which we're almost ready for. I think that'll do. That'll definitely activate Brill. And it wasn't even needed. Cardomancer is. Uh, 
Um, does that affect me or the enemy or both? I'm not sure. I don't think I want that really. Uh, I'll, I'll just take gold. Oh. The cave troll wandered into me. Alrighty then. Do the same thing we usually do. Do the card draw. Uh, Fury! Oh yeah, that affects ourselves. Or it adds bonus to us. That's good. So uh, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. But they're going to heal too, so um, if I could, I would draw. I guess we'll deal two damage. I don't want them to activate Fury until it's too late. Ah, uh, come on. Come on, I want the card draw. One, two, three, four, five, six. Well, I think this should kill him anyway, so whatever. Ooh, yeah. I'll have that. Definitely. No question about it. Uh, and then we'll put that there and put that there. We'll fight this thing for the diamond. And then we'll go into the goal. Our objective. This will cause us to deal a damage anyway. Which is nice. Mm. Well, that's annoying. Counter, counter that, I guess. That's also slightly annoying. Also, I'm not getting any card draw cards. We are whittling the Earth Elemental down, though. Which is nice. Ah, uh, that's not going to help. I guess we'll do that now. Ah, nice. The Brill will kill them. Uh, nah. Yes. I'll take that. And... Do that, I guess. Getting all of the diamonds now, apparently. Now, if I could... No. I need to go for that diamond. Damn it. Oh, we don't even get it. Right. Here's to you, young dungeoneer. You stood your ground and acted very brave. But how long before you feel the fear? And how long before you're... In your grave. <laughs> right. So that's that quest. Let's get on to quest three. We'll keep using the cardomancer because that worked out pretty, uh, pretty nicely. Um, and we'll take a stab at killing the dwarf magnet.
We are at the 20 minute mark, but we're going to see if we can do this anyway. And that's quite unfortunate as far as rooms go, although that works, I guess. Death Ray. Oh dear. I am going to... Um, I'm going to assume that that is an insta-kill. That is, that it will insta-kill me if I take too long. So we probably want to go straight through if we can. As straight as possible at least. That's all our cards, so I'm just going to unleash that on you. And your brills that killed you. That was lovely. Uh, we'll have the fork, I guess. Oh, they're coming for us. You don't wander, so that's good. Uh, do we have anything that can bridge this gap? Yeah, that'll do. Hopefully our dungeoneer will not go for that. We'll go for the boss directly. We'll put a miner in the way there. Oh, that was probably a bad idea. Uh -huh. I gained health. Parkour. Right, start with more cards, which is nice. What happens if you trigger a card draw with no cards to draw? Can't imagine that would go very well. I'll take that. The Doom Plate. We'll put some gold on there to make sure that we go straight for the boss and not... I mean, I guess we have plenty of time, really. But it's too late now, isn't it? Oh! It actually doubles the effect of the blocking It actually gave us two health because we blocked both of the damage because of that card. Interesting. Hmm. That is very nice combo. A very nice combo. Hmm. Just going to do that, I guess. I'm going to get Fury, but I'm pretty sure we're going to kill it now. Oh. Well, um... That's all pretty useless. We'll just use that. Well, we'll gain one health from that. So that's better than nothing. Demon Claw is definitely better than the Fork. And then we'll just get the Magnet. What is that? 
Is that a flask? Game conceal. Fine. You can have your conceal. Doesn't matter. I'm just going to card draw anyway. Aw, oh, man. You caused me to discard. But then I drew more cards because... Well... Because I'm a cardomancer. Sheesh, that's a lot of damage. We're going to get Fury now. I'm going to use magic attacks. I guess. Uh, and I'm dead. Shoot. Oh, well. Right. I'm going to end the episode here. <laughs> Once again, they tried in vain to overcome and not be slain. But overrun and very scared, our heroes fell in battle. <laughs> and we'll try again in the next one. So, I will see you then.